Hello there, YouTube. Alright, since I felt really bored today, I'm gonna do something really crazy. So, here we have a case fan, and here is a normal graphics card heatsink. This graphics card is a 8400GS. I'm gonna attempt to put this into this by prying a few things apart. Alright, let's attempt this. Alright, so since my screwdriver can do everything, so I'm gonna try using scissors. Should work pretty well because this plastic is pretty damn soft. Okay, I've killed most of it. I'm gonna try to tear this off. All right, as you can see now, the pins are taken out of their little slot, which is what's left of it. Whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in correctly. Ground to the right, red to the left. Plug it down, nice and firm, that's good. I stuffed some plastic in, because, well, it wouldn't hold on properly, so. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go test this out in a sec. See how this thing works, if it works. Okay, so I took out my GTX 660. As you can see right here, it's a game word blower fan. It's a heat sink and everything. I'm going to replace it with this 8400GS midget card. I'm going to turn the lights on. Okay, focus. There's this, which I'm going to put in. Hopefully the fan won't come off. Ah, stupid cable. Stupid. Alright. Seem to have got it in. Ah, shit, what the hell. Nice. Oh yeah, by the way, this is my new computer that I built. I killed the Pentium 4. No, I didn't really put the fan back in. Hey, it works. <laughs> Let's see how it performs. I'm doing some drivers for it. Oh yeah, this is my, this is my uh, i5. Z77X UD5H MOBO. As you can see here, a shitload of Hard drives, uh, DVD rewritable optical drive, load boards on the side, it's pretty nice, I like it, yeah, okay, I also have four huge case fans in this thing, and the Kentec 1050 watt, huh, seems legit. Alright, I'll see you once I've booted up and everything. Alright, so I... <coughs> okay, so I installed the card, I installed the drivers necessary to run the card, and right now I'm on speed fan. Just checking all the stuff. I'll show you to prove that this is the 8400GS. There you go, 8400GS. 512 DDR2 memory. Uh, it's pretty nice stuff. <laughs> Actually, I might want to overclock it. <laughs> Maybe. 
Anyway, let's see if I can. Okay. Seems to be pretty fast. Seems. <coughs> it's a nice entry level card. You can see here it's uh, 42 frames per second. There's max settings in Minecraft. If you reduce it a bit, it should be a lot faster. around a bit. As you can see it's lowest is around 20. But it's still playable. <coughs> Alright, that should be it. I'm going to show you uh, the rig again. Same as a fan or anything. As you can see it's right quite nicely there. Oh shit! I see I broke the fan, oh, no, oh no, that's bad. As you can see, it's running quite nicely, that's stuck. Oops, I broke my cold master fan. Oh yeah, that feels unstable. Okay, yeah, that should be it. Right, let's check the temperatures. Max temperature seems to be 69 to 70 degrees. So I think it's pretty good. Alright, see you later, guys. Peace out.